Hello everyone, this is Ikimizuna here. Welcome back to my OP of Pokemon Fire Red. In the last episode, we um, got to this Pokemon Center near Mount Moon and went through Route 3. And this episode, we will go through Mount Moon. Anyway, right here. Hello there, Sweet Pie. Hey! What the world are you to- What? I never even noticed that dialogue. Sweetie Pie, really? So I'll go. I'll let you have a secret Pokemon, a magic card, for just 500 bucks. No, I don't want that. I know I don't have a fishing rod yet, but I don't want that. Not now. Not ever, really. That's not the water Pokemon I'm going to be catching. Or getting. Eh. Not Moon. Here we go. I'm going to put up a repel. Well, actually, no, I will not put up a repel just yet. Because I want to look for a Pokemon for my team. And that's not it. Let's see. Gino, get out of here. Um, I'll show all the Pokemon in the cave. Or, not live. And, uh, and then cut out the rest of the battles whenever they reappear. You know. This is a Geodude, of course. Ground, rock, rock, ground type, I think. Yeah, it, it has... correctly. Okay, there's a thing down here. Bullet seed. Eh, I won't be teaching that thing. Zubat. If this was Pokemon Emerald or any other game, I would be catching this and using it on my team, but this time, since it won't involve a Crobat, um, happiness, because there's no happiness in this game, which makes me sad, um, that's a no-go. I love Zubat, by the way. It's one of my favorites. Well, it really, Crobat's one of my favorites. I really like Zubat itself. By itself. Just, just a wish it could be. <laughs> just Thundershock it. Oh, come on. Haha. That's on Pichu's ability. I mean, Zeodine's ability static. Going into a bed like when it hit, it hit Zeodine, um, he got paralyzed. So that's a good thing. And King Grid level 7, hooray! Needs some more levels. Let's see what's over here. Oh, come on. Okay. Well, that battle's over. Nobody leveled up. And here's a Paralyze heal. Paralyze. Oh, I didn't mean it. I'll cut him out. I'll tell you what Pokemon he had at the moment. So. <laughs> King grew, um... Uh, three levels in that fight because I just let him do it alone because it's just a Weedle and a Kakuna and he had Peck, so. Oh, before I forget. Um, summary. I wanted to switch Peck to where Veer is like that. So it can just be more organized and stuff on the attacks. Anyway. Now I'm going to fight that girl over there. Okay, now I got that over. This girl actually has the Pokemon I want that's in this area, but I'm going to go find it. Okay, let's continue on. Hopefully I'll find the Pokemon I want. Very soon. Actually, you know what? Uh, I do want to find the Pokemon, but I'm just going to hang around the entrance to go find it. Because it doesn't matter where you are. Oh, look at Paris. Paris Hilton. That's what I call it. Um, this is a bug poison type. Not very good type. I would usually use it as a HM slave. I think I was gonna catch it for an HM slave. Eh. Darn you, king. <laughs> I'll, I'll find it. There's a 100% chance of catch, finding one in another passage of the thing. So I'm not too upset about not catching it right now. Anyway. I'll stay around the entrance right here, just because I need to go to Quick Heal or something. And I'll see if I can find the Pokemon I want. Be right back. Finally! Oh my god. Wait, it's male. God damn it. I was going to name it something girly. Oh, I know what I can name this. I brought Pikachu out, so uh, Poison Point wouldn't 
back to and through all of them, yeah. Anyway, I'm going to catch Clary until about 30 minutes on my recording time. Oh, goodness gracious. I'm going to count how many Zubats I encountered, too, just so you know how frustrating it was to try to find this thing. Luckily, I had a perfect name for it. It was female or male. I got the Clefairy, finally. Its adorable appearance makes it popular as a pet. However, it's rare and difficult to find. No shit! I'm going to nickname this thing. <laughs> I love it. Hey, Bill. Just as I run out. Just as I run out. <sighs> anyway, um, I'm actually gonna um, stop the recording here and make a new one so I won't have to process this video for so long. So I'll see you guys in one itty bitty 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 second. It'll probably take a few minutes to um, render, process, whatever you want to call it. BRB. Okay, I'm back. Um, I actually had to take a very long break after recording the last footage of this episode. Because... stuff. Anyway, now that everything is over and I had a shower and blah, let's actually get on with this. By going through Mount Moon! Hooray. Let's see, is Bill up in front? I love his name. As, as we all know, um, Bill is, you know, in the Pokemon game. He turns into a cool fairy. That's the reason I named that. Oh. I didn't even checked his nature yet, I don't think. What is your nature? Oh, it's brave. He's a brave bill. A brave bullet bill. No, I'm just kidding. Oh. Let's go around this girl. I'll fight her later. Maybe never. Who knows? Anyway, let's go through here. If I happen to find another cool fairy, I may replace Bill. Now in this little section right here, you always have 100% encounter rate of Paris. I actually caught a Paris off screen and it slayed Hilton. <laughs> because I felt like it. And plus I needed somebody with cut and flash for future references. And that would be Slay Hilton. <laughs> I didn't get his own stun spore effect. I mean, effect spore effect <laughs> on me, but whatever. Okay, um, I just realized I need some repels of being done right now, because I'm silly. Also, um, Bill leveled up to level 9, and he learned to sing. He's also paralyzed, and has 14 HP. Not good. I'll use my last potion. Well, second to last. Luckily, I bought some paralyzed heals back in Viridian City, because, yeah. Anyway. I like how Bill is already opening up to me, which is weird. But, uh, never mind. I'll say it later. Oh, look! We, Team Rocket, are Pokemon gangsters. We strike fear with our strength. Oh, really? I wonder what his name is. Grunt. Game. Make every single Team Rocket one. <sighs> anyway, this is Shanshu. Let's get you know out here. I say so. That's a thing to do. Fight with him. Super effective! Yay. Ah, I guess I'm 
guess it's too bad. You plan to fish me off with that quick attack for a new game. King, you're level 11. Thousands left on so he had no choice. Thunder shot. Yay! Oh. Nice. <laughs> uh, it's because he has an adamant nature. That makes him get more attack than special attack. But I don't care. His nature's not really only hinder it slightly. So. It. I can say something about that, but I don't want to. Uh, over here is an item. Let's get it. Star piece. We can sell that. Hooray! Also, notice how we go up the stairs slowly. Right, that's what it looked like to me. Oh, I just remembered I can run. Ugh, I keep forgetting this. I'm stupid. I'm thinking of the older games. I'm going the wrong way. Wait. Wait a second. Oh, what the? Oh, it's because I have a flurry up. Am I through yet? Okay. Mm. Oh, I need to heal up King. And then my last potion. <laughs> I thought I got a repel, barely not. Okay. Repel, please. Thank you. Oh, I did get a potion. Ooh. Yay! I avoided the encounter with that guy. Rare candy. Very nice. That guy over there has a Magnemite and a Voltorb, I think. I could be wrong about that, but... I know he has a Magnemite, so if you have Charmander, that'd be very nice to fight against him. Get the ball. Escape rope. Very nice. Probably gonna use that in a, in a second. Now, this guy's not a trainer, so let's talk to him. Hi, I'm Escap- mm. This, excuse me. I'm excavating for fossils here under Mount Moon. Sometimes brought with the Yeah, okay. He helps. Here, because it's a trainer over there. Ooh, that's close. Uh, Bell grew to level 10 in that fight, and the repels of that tore off. Oh, great. We have two repels. This ain't going to end well. I should actually try to fight some trainers, but I'm lazy. I'll just fight the necessary ones. Eh. I'm encountering all the level 10 Pokemon here. Eh. Uh, over there, there's nothing on that rock. And here's TM46 Thief. Actually, not terrible. Because there's a thief right here. Level 10s, go away. Okay. Here's an ether over here, or another. Whichever you want to pronounce it. It's acceptable ones. Okay, that's that's enough of this. Um, I'm switching Zeodyne to the, the or Geno, or someone that's not level 10 up to the front. Because apparently I get all the level 10 Pokemon out of the way. I guess that's a good way of getting the highest level Pokemon out of here. <laughs> Think about it. Okay. Let's see if I can... Okay, I got that battle out of the way. Here's something that I'm going to use in a very long time in the future. A Moonstone. It evolves Clefairy into Clefable. But, of course, I'm not going to do that yet, because that would be stupid. At the moment, yeah. Strong King Mia. It's getting weak. And if my Pokemon, if one of my Pokemon is fans, I will use an escape room and get out of here. And then cut back to where I was. Anyway. Okay. Repel time. My last repel. Where is it? Right here. Oh, no, don't use the star piece. What would I use that? Revive. I didn't I can get one this early. Oh well. That's actually pretty neat. Oh yeah, I just remembered. <laughs> I'm silly. Um, you can actually...
<laughs> uh, I'm actually going to try to catch this again. Because I really don't like Bill. I don't like Bill's own nature, so let's see what this one has as a nature. I can't believe I can capture two little fairies in this whole place. The other one took 30 minutes, this one took 13 minutes. Uh, recording time. Or it just makes you only use multiple moves and not change moves. Anyway. Let's see. Oh. <laughs> so that's I may actually try to name it something else. Like Bays or something. Aww. If you know what I mean. From Final Fantasy, he's the main character from Final Fantasy 4. Um, the reason I named him that because it sounds a lot like Celeste, and Celeste is a girl's name. You know, Cecil, Celeste. Eh, whatever. I'm not, I'm not good with my reasonings. Because I've to search for 30 minutes for Bill, and then two Clefairies pop up right after another. What is this crap? And King is sleep. At least that's him, Pokemon. Gina, no way, Zio died. So, what am I going to name this one? What I was going to originally name it in the first place. This is female. Thank you. What is with my love today? I guess getting a shower helps. Or, you know, a break. Yeah. My heart is pounding. I want to catch this. And be a good nature thing. Yes. One more time. No critical hits. Okay, good. Like that was good. That's besides the point. Um, Pokeball. Well, not really from Final Fantasy, it's just a common celestial name. Eh, come on. If it's another fairy, I swear to God. <laughs> That's about to say. Now I'm going to train Celeste up instead of Bill and Cecil. Look at this, look at this crap. I mean, gentle and timid. I can't tell which one's the better nature. That's the best stat. Hmm. Of what I want to use. I like Celeste a little bit better. Goody. And they were early young. You know what? I'm going to go back to the Pokemon Center. And just, uh. Yeah. I'm, even though I'm almost out of here. 
Um, as I was trying to say before, before I was interrupted by the second Clefairy, Cecil, um, I was going to, I needed to have two Moonstones. One for Celeste and one for King. This is the rocket grunt and I can't avoid it. Oh, you get poison. There you go. You get poison. Alright. Oh, he's fast asleep. I didn't even notice. I forgot. <laughs> Stupid. Anyway. At least I poisoned him.
magical fairies. What what is my life right now? Uh let's name this one Terra after Terra from um six. Or I could name it Tina. Yeah, let's name it Tina instead, so it's like Tina's awesome the Japanese name. Tina. Yeah, good job. Wonder which one's better. Let me check. Jolly? Eh. Eh. I'm going to put Celeste up in front. I like Celeste a little bit better. Just, um, nature-wise. Sounds a bit more accurate. Uh, let's see. Because I want to. I'm not gonna... No, I hadn't saved this whole time. I'm like, ugh. Well, since I started recording again. Hey, stop! I found these fossils. They're both mine! No! They're both. One of them can be mine! Oh, it's a super nerd. Not a scientist. He has the same surprise, whatever. So let's. Let's just see. Hey, it worked! This is kind of a physical wall, so I'm just going to... Let's make you get some... Ah. So we can get some fighting. So. Well, I just need Zeta. I need some experience. Go oh, Zeta! I'm kind of glad that he's asleep. Okay. Uh, and once he's um, awake again, I can paralyze him. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, I just want to say. Oh, he's the bubble guy that's doing this. Eh. Whatever. Just die. He hasn't seen Grammar yet in the LP. Of course not. Um, he's at, he actually gave up to the Grand Soul, honestly. Just by the surface. Sold on city based on Kyoto or something. That city? I could be wrong. I know it's that part city's based on Tokyo, obviously. Or is that it's a tower there? Oh that's true. I should have that up. I know she was based on Kyoto or Tokyo. Yeah. Well it's not talk about that, that right now. Oh, Celeste. I'm coughing. Oh, great. Uh, down. She's just saying. No, wait, no. I didn't hit again. How very accurate. So. It actually has no accuracy, apparently. That's surprise is working. Like, 79%. Hey. Don't get me wrong. I see it using self-destruct, I'm getting pissed off. Yeah, I'm it. Well, if he actually tackles me, he'll fall in love. Well, no. Not this time. Darn it. Yeah. So that's three level 13. Very nice. Double slap. Because I still want to have an accurate hitting move. She's packed at the moment. So, whatever. You want to check the Full tour? Ah, uh, yes. Gina, you're up. Okay, a sleep powder. All these sleepy foods. Oh. Well, that missed. Ouch. He screeched at me. Okay. It's not screeching at me. It's annoying. Well, it hurts my ears. Die. Stop it! Oh, he's dead anyway. It's not bad. I guess we just want this. That's the fence, partially. 
Miguel. Miguel. Okay, I'll share. Of course you'll share. Sharing is good. Uh, take a fossil. Uh, I want the Helix fossil, to be honest. But this one's the dome fossil, which turns into Kabuto. This one turns into Almanite, which I do want. Maybe I'll use it. Probably not. Why do you get a jingle? That makes no sense. Whatever. Get out of here. Well, that was handy. If I did get poisoned. Whoosh. Very nice. Now I'm out here. Okay, these two guys. I didn't want to talk to one of them. Punch with roaring ferocity. Type with destructive power. When the chips are down, Mega Punch is the ultimate attack. You agree? Yes? Now, let me teach it to your Pokemon. Yes, it can only be learned once, but I'm going to teach it to Celeste, because it will have the same type of attack bonus, and stuff. Uh, let's see, I'll go to replace it with Cal. How much accuracy does this have, by the way? I actually didn't change. Crap. <laughs> Very nice. I may talk to him later, if I have a kick him. Well, at has 80 power. That's fine. I mean, so she'll be a situational Pokemon. Yeah. That's fine. Roar! Not useful. To me, at least. Maybe some other time. But not now. And now we are in... Wait for it. Cerulean City. Oh, uh, yes. I'm gonna stop right here. Because it's gone long... Uh, gone on long enough with my four... My four... Oh, God. My four Clefairies. I almost forgot what Pokemon it was. <laughs> I have four Clefairies. <laughs> oh my god. I mean... I can't believe it. No, not much wrong. I want to move Tina to the PC. Because I'm not going to use her. Sadly, no. I'm going to use Celeste. I say so. Anyway, the next episode of Pokemon um, Fire Red, we will go to Nugget Bridge, which is the bridge up, there, up, um, over, up on top of the... Up north. There you go. And, um, stuff. I'll see you guys next time on Let's Play Pokemon Fire Red. Bye for now.